Uh, yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Dr. PG and the Empress. Gotta get money back for another YouTube video. Banger, man. Yes, sir. Yes, man. I know what time it is. The doctor's in the house. Today, I want to talk about a situation where, man, you know, reportedly, uh, uh, Mayweather promotions, you know, Floyd Mayweather and Leonard Ellerby, man, they have, they have parted ways. They separated, you know, and they, a lot of people in the boxing world, you know, um, know them as a staple, you know, it's like this, them breaking up may seem essentially inconsequential to most of the, most of the people who just watch the fight, you know what I'm saying? But if you're around boxing a lot and you notice certain people being around each other, man, you know, Leonard Ellaby and Floyd go together like, 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 like macaroni and cheese, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, so it's, it's like, it's them breaking up. It's similar to like Big Boy and, and, and Andre 3000 and Outkast. <laughs> So, you know, Leonard LB has been uh, or with Floyd since his since his fighting days, you know what I'm saying? He helps with a lot of promotion. He, he played a key role and a central role in bringing us Floyd versus Pacquiao, amongst other fights, you know. He serves as a promoter, CEO of Mayweather Promotions, and, you know, um, and, and helped him out in a lot of other business endeavors, you know. And and I don't think this this is a good sign. I can't say how bad it is. I can't say. It might be a good thing, you know. Maybe it's a... Maybe it's going in another direction, change of pace, and, you know, maybe it might be good for me with the promotion, but the timing is just bad, of course, you know, with some, some fighters. Uh, notably leaving uh, uh, Mayweather Promotions re recently, and, and you know, and <clears throat> you know what I'm saying, other things going on, you know, especially with the whole Floyd Dubai stuff, which we debunked, but, um, you know, it's just a lot of things going on right now, you know, and, and, and the rumors with PBC and all this stuff, so like I, guess, I don't think it's anything to panic, but I do think that, uh, I don't know, if, I don't know if it's, maybe it's a mutual splitting, um, it sounds like there could be a firing. We don't know, or maybe maybe uh, Leonard Ellaby made a step down. You know, they could have parted ways. But let's read it directly from the horse's mouth. You know, what I'm saying from Floyd, from what Floyd Mayweather posted on his Instagram. But before we get to that, too, I want to also say that it's very interesting because I saw it on another channel in a clip. I believe it was on Sean Zatel's channel where he was, where Leonard Ellaby was recently asked, like uh, earlier this week, I believe, if he was planning on leaving Mayweather promotions. He he. He came out and said no emphatically. He was like, no, I'm staying with Mayweather Promotions. All that stuff is just rumors, essentially, and he ignores them. Did you see some of the rumors flying around about Leonard might be leaving Mayweather Promotions? Man, I don't listen to none of that stuff. Is there any truth to any of that? No, no, no. Bullshit! Bullshit! I mean, that's why uh, the fast forward a few days later to where we're at now, it's kind of surprising that Floyd would drop something uh, um, essentially contradicting that statement from Leonard Ellaby. So let's read it right now. So it says Floyd Mayweather. This is this is Floyd Mayweather's IG account, you know, so, you know, all the important news are, are is announced and on IG and Twitter. If it's if it's, if it's real, it's going to be IG and Twitter. You know what I'm talking about? That's a fact, ain't it? Ain't it? I did. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't official if it's not on social media. But let's read it, man. It says Floyd Mayweather. Uh, Mayweather Promotions would like to extend our deepest gratitude to Leonard Ellaby for his exceptional leadership and unwavering dedication over the years. Leonard has been an integral part of our team, contributing to numerous business endeavors that have played a pivotal role in the success of Mayweather Promotions. After years of hard work and dedication, Leonard has made the heartfelt decision to step down as CEO to spend more time with his family and loved ones. You see, that sounds kind of funny right once one, on one hand Leonard will be saying he's not leaving Mayweather promotions and then on this hand it says that he chose to step down so it could be just you know a, a save the face and stuff like that you know um, but let, let's keep going um, he says we have the utmost respect for his decision and are incredibly grateful for his leadership that has helped shape Mayweather promotions into the thriving organization that it is today as we move forward we are excited to announce that Mayweather promotions will be joining forces with Richard Schaefer a highly sought after finance expert and a phenomenal founder in the world of promotional boxing with over 40 years of experience combined just to give you a um a brief synopsis on who Richard Schaefer is. Uh, he was a former CEO of Golden Boy Promotions. <laughs> so, you know, it's, it, it's just funny how, how, how things works out, you know, how things work out. You know, Floyd and Oscar De La Hoya's history, you know, and, 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 and PBC and, and Golden Boy's history, you know. So this is this is funny, right? So um, let's, let's, let me pick up where I left off. Richard Schaefer is a highly sought after finance expert and a phenomenal founder in the world of promotional boxing with over 40 years experience combined. Together, we will expand our presence by establishing Mayweather headquarters in L.A., Los Angeles. Our goal is to elevate Mayweather promotions to global success. 
supporting fighters worldwide and assisting them in making rewarding business decisions that will benefit them well beyond their boxing careers. We look forward to this new chapter and the continued global success of Mayweather Promotions. So this is very interesting, man. Like I said, I wish I wish them the best. Y'all know I, 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 how uh, you know Floyd is definitely uh, a goat or one of the well, he's he's definitely the goat or one of the goats in in, in the sport of boxing. And I like to see when uh, um, boxers could c- continue their success and w- with other endeavors, especially in the business side uh, of, of the sport of boxing. You know what I'm saying? I think I think Floyd is. Um, Despite whether you like him or not, I think I think he's a treasure and he's he's definitely uh contributes a lot uh, um in a positive is a positive manner to many boxing many boxers that come uh, after him, you know what I'm saying, like um his successors, you know. And and I heard that he even takes care of some of his predecessors as well, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, I I don't, I don't really like this, but as I learn more information on it, I will let y'all know. I don't all this is all I know right now on the surface level, you know, Mayweather announced that him and Leonard Ella B are party ways, you know, but we still see Leonard Ella be active in Tank's career, you know, so that doesn't mean that he's going to disappear out, out, out the boxing landscape. So some, some of y'all might wish that he does, you know, <laughs> I don't know. This, this, I'm, not, I'm not bestowing any judgment. I'm just telling y'all what it is. Leonard Ella B and Mayweather Promotions have appeared to part ways, at least for now. So I'll, I'll let y'all know more updates as I get it, man. Appreciate y'all rocking me as always. Um, don't forget to like the video and as well, remember with God, we can do anything without God, we're nothing. Y'all be easy. The doctor's out. Peace. From the hood to college, both worlds they had to meet Six degrees between us, so cold we're about to freeze But we're Florida boys, hot takes, we bring the heat We're moving the culture, the engineers to the streets